how does one clear on emotions that you've blocked the memory, like a family trauma, molestation, and abduction, mind control projects? Mm -hmm. Okay, so people, when you're in an emotion, there is no memory, there's no thought. So the bottom line is this, you don't have to remember anything because your body already still holds the emotional charge. The emotion is still in your physical body, okay? So if you, like let's just say, let's just say that you, let's just say that you're dealing with, you know, like severe abuse, okay? And you don't have memory. But what you but what you do have a knowing of is how you feel emotionally. So maybe you know some uh, someone might yell, and all of a sudden you find yourself on the floor. Okay, when I used to do the my workshops that were called cutting to the core, and if my team thought this was intense, cutting to the core was intense. Okay, so when when you find yourself in an emotional reaction. If you can just surrender to that emotional reaction, you don't need the freaking story, people, okay? You're, it's already in you. You don't need to remember anything. But once you are in a reactive state, when something triggers you and you're having an emotion, if you can just let yourself have it, drop into it, lose all mind thoughts, then you start to move and you embrace and you're knowing the frequencies of all the traumas from your childhood and the energy is leaving the body and then the memories come. That's usually how it works. Oftentimes when I would do, you know, take people in, they'd be going into these emotional states and they go through it, but then all of a sudden all the memories would start to come. Okay. So even though you've got buried memories, it doesn't matter. The energy can still be cleared. You don't have to know. You don't have to remember. All you got to go after is the emotion. That's all you need. When you can surrender to that emotion all the way and let go, memories will come, but keep staying in the emotion. So nothing exists but that emotion. So you are that emotion. Whatever that is, you are it. Nothing exists but that, okay? And that's when the unraveling and the releasing of the trauma, the shock, all of that energy starts to come out. It leaves the body, okay? So people, you don't have to remember anything. All you got to do is, is drop in and surrender when an emotion arises. It's that simple. And people like, for example, like Chris and Abby, they were witness to that kind of thing happening at the seminar. Okay. Cause people got activated big time. I mean, I, I didn't want to, it's like crazy, crazy friggin' big time activations happening. And most people went in, right? Chris and Abby, most people went in. And what happened when they came out? You guys want to say something about that? They were completely transformed. They were yeah. a completely different person. They had completely released whatever was associated with that emotion, the belief, the programming, the condition, whatever was holding on, mm -hmm. they were gone. And mm -hmm. so by the time they were done releasing, it's like you're looking at a new version of them. I know, so cool. Okay, people, I know, you know, I know that people don't want to go in and face themselves. I know that. I know people don't want to have to feel. They don't want to feel their heart breaking. They don't want to feel intensity. And I'm sorry, yet if you've had that kind of intensity, you're going to have to know it. Even if it's for five minutes. What's five minutes out of your life of facing an extreme intensity for liberation? Come on. Let's get real here. It's like, oh, it's like this. It's like a toothache. You got this toothache, okay? Oh, man, take some aspirin. Like, oh, and you keep living with this toothache. Finally, you go, okay, I'm gonna, it's going to hurt like heck, but I'm going to go have it pulled. All right, fine. A few seconds of excruciating pain, and it's over. Okay? So that, think of it that way. You can, you can handle a few minutes of excruciating pain to be liberated, people. Right, guys? Right, right, Abby? Right, Chris? Absolutely. <laughs> We're in this together. We got in it together, and it's going to take us to get take us that's, together to get out of it. That's right. Things. That's exactly right. We're in it together. And good news is, people, I've done massive amounts of emotional clearing on myself, massive amounts. And I have had a lifetime that knows so many facets of life. So, yes, I know. I know what happens. I know how to do it. I know the I know the the power of liberation. <laughs>